Our next award category of the night is We All We Got, We All We Need. Celebrating mutual aid organizations providing for their neighbors. When the city closed down, schools transitioned to virtual, school lunches disappeared, food pantries paused distribution. The most basic needs were a stretch for so many families. Folks were choosing between groceries and utility bills, and unemployment reached an all-time high. From community fridges attached to small businesses, to pop-up free food in city parks, to top-level chefs cooking in their communities, to distributing masks when PPE was impossible to find, our nominees went the extra mile to lend a hand to their neighbors through mutual aid, which proudly upholds the motto, Solidarity, not charity. The We All We Got, We All We Need Award. Celebrating mutual aid organizations providing for their neighbors. And the nominees are Sonam and Sonia Parikh. The People's Fridge combats hunger in West Philadelphia by providing fresh food to the community for free. The initiative encourages the neighborhood to give and take freely from the fridge and upholds the values of community care and food as a human right. Everyone should have access to fresh food, no questions asked. Everybody Eats Philly, Stephanie Willis, Kurt Evans, Aziza Young, Gregory Hedden, and Malik Ali. As protests surged and the pandemic bore down, a group of black Philadelphia chefs decided to step up. Using their industry connections, they sourced donated ingredients and turned them into meals for families and residents facing food insecurity. Eugene Desyatnik, Sew Face Masks Philadelphia. More than 30,000 face masks were donated by this collective, whose leaders recruited dozens of sewers, sourced cloth and materials, and then distributed the PPE to anyone who needed it. Gina Harris and Katie Briggs, the West Philly Bunny Hop. Jumping into action, this donation-based grocery supply hub was one of the first groups to organize regular deliveries to family and people who were homebound or unable to afford regular food shopping because of pandemic hardships. And the winner is... Sonam and Sonia Parikh, The People's Fridge. Congrats. Thank you. I'm so excited to receive this award. Um, first and foremost, I would like to note that community fridges have been going on for hundreds of years now. Um, before we opened one in 2020, uh, community fridges have been a concept worldwide. Um, and we're only working off of the foundation that was created by folks before us for generations. Um, we're also living in a city that has opened its arms for us, that um, there have been hundreds of groups of people that are doing the foundations and works of mutual aid, and we're only following in their footsteps. Um, I'd like to mention that the People's Fridge is just a small part of a big, big organization and a big mutual aid um, community within the Philadelphia area. Um, of course, the People's Fridge would not be running without my amazing group of um, volunteers that help me run the fridge every single day. Mina's World, if they were being like the best host that a fridge could ever have. Um, West Philly for allowing me to place the fridge there. And um, just like, again, for all of the people before us that laid out the groundwork for what mutual aid can truly be today. Um, also, the other three organizations that are um, stand beside me, um, they are so amazing and they do the work every single day and they are examples for the People's Bridge on how to work together in a community and do amazing and great things. And I am so surprised and so honored. And I would also like to thank my mom and dad.